Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. In the previous video, I promised that today we will be speaking about how to love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Well, if you think about it, that is really very intuitive. Let me give you an example. If someone gives you a big gift like a luxury car, for example, will you forgive? Will you forget them? Not in all our life. A luxury car is unforgettable. If we give you 10 cars, not 10, even 100 cars, but we cut one of your legs instead, will you agree? Of course, there is no sane human being who agrees on that. Why? Because the leg that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives us is a way more valuable than not a hundred car, but even a thousand luxury car. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala not only gave us one leg, but he gave us two legs, two hands, two ears, and two eyes. Imagine you are blind. How your life will be. Not only that, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave us health, wealth, family, and also, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created everything on earth for us. Even the sun, the moon, the stars are created for us. Endless and countless blessings. And also Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala promised us, if we are good in this life, we'll be granted a better life in the akhirah, in Jannah. And in that life, we'll be gathered and assembled with righteous people, with prophets, and even Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala promised us to see him in Jannah. All these countless blessings are not enough for us to love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. A luxury car is unforgettable. All these kind of blessings are not enough for us to make us love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If we don't really love Allah deep from our hearts, that means our feelings, our hearts, our mentalities, our mind, our thinking, and even our iman has a problem. Definitely. How come with all these kinds of blessings and givings, we don't love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? That's why Rabbi al adawiya who is a pious woman, used to say, which means, Ya Allah, if you know, and Allah definitely knows what is deep in the heart, if you know that I worship you because I hope that I enter your paradise, deprive me from it. And if you know that I worship you to save myself from your fire, burn me in it. But I worship you because you are a God that deserves to be worshipped and deserves to be loved. That is true love. That is true love. See you in the next video. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.